guys! My name is Camille and I'm going to teach you how to create beautiful, realistic, dynamic 3D clothing for your 3D models. You can use the clothes for games, 3D animations, films, and for digital doubles in films, for 3D printable action figures, and for DAS, Poser, iClone, etc. In case you don't know what MD is, in short, it's a program to quickly create dynamic 3D clothes without needing to sculpt wrinkles for hours in a program like ZBrush. You can also animate the clothes. Simply bring in your animated model, press the record button, and the program will animate the clothes for you. So what will I be teaching you? In the six and a half hour beginner's course, I cover in depth all the functions and buttons in Marvelous Designer, the do's and don'ts, what every tool is, and how best to use it. Once you know how to use the tools, it's time to make some cool clothes. The advanced workshops are over 42 hours long. I teach you the basics of how to create all kinds of clothes and share with you every technique and trick I've learned. The workshops cover how to create shirts and hoodies, jackets and coats, a three-piece tuxedo, all kinds of sleeves, pants, skirts, dresses, capes, cloaks, hoods and hats. In short, all you'll need to get started, making awesome, marvelous clothes. Here's a breakdown of what you'll learn in the Shirts and Tops workshop. The basics of how to create and modify a shirt to fit the model, how to make a sleeveless tank top, how to add wash tags and logos onto your clothes, how to make shoulder straps that cross over the back or tie around the neck, how to create a tennis t-shirt, how to add seams and stitches on your clothes, how to make a raglan sleeve shirt, how to make two kinds of dolman shirts, how to make a sensual soft hanging cowl shirt, how to recreate a designer shirt with a golden pattern overlay, how to create an elegant woman's shirt with a lace panel, how to create a formal woman's shirt with buttons, cuffs and a collar, and how to create this shirt with shearing strips on the waist. As for men's shirts, I'll teach you how to make a basic men's tank top and t-shirt, a men's polo shirt and a buttoned men's shirt with cuffs and a collar. I'll also teach you how to create a woman's hoodie and a men's hoodie. Next, in the jackets workshop, you'll learn how to create an elegant woman's jacket with a notched collar, a woman's winter jacket, a men's windbreaker jacket, a men's rain jacket, a men's double-breasted coat, a men's dawn sweater jacket, a men's quilted jacket, and a men's quilted bomber jacket. You'll learn how to make pockets, buttons, hoods, collars, cuffs, as well as advanced techniques how to easily create quilting, how to create a puffed effect, and how to create fine details, such as those lovely tiny wrinkles, and even how to control how many wrinkles there are and in what direction they go, up or down. In the tuxedo workshop, you'll learn how to create suit pants, a suit shirt with cuff links and a suit tie, as well as a tuxedo shirt with a pleated front and a bow tie. I'll also teach you how to create a tuxedo vest, and how to make a tuxedo jacket with three kinds of colors notched collar, peaked collar and shawl collar. In the sleeves workshop you'll learn how to create all the most common kinds of sleeves that you'll need for jackets, shirts, dresses, cloaks, etc. I'll start with the basics of how to make a one-piece sleeve and a two-piece sleeve and then I'll teach you how to make angel sleeves, several kinds of bishop sleeves, including a big fancy bishop sleeve, hanging sleeves, kimono sleeves, lantern sleeves, open shoulder sleeves, three kinds of puffed sleeves, regular puffed sleeve, puffed bottom sleeve and puffed off a regular sleeve, a Juliet sleeve, leg of mutton sleeves, also known as gigot sleeves, petal sleeves, ruffle butterfly sleeves, and a quick tip how to make a twisted sleeve that does not untwist itself. Next, in the skirts workshop, I'll teach you how to create a basic gathered skirt, a flared skirt, paneled skirt, a gourd skirt, a tube skirt, a layered ruffle skirt, a petal tulip skirt, a handkerchief skirt, a layered handkerchief skirt, a paneled handkerchief skirt, a belly dancer handkerchief skirt, and how to turn an asymmetric handkerchief skirt into a fairy skirt, as well as how to make a peasant skirt, a tiered skirt, a star skirt, a layered witch skirt, a fancy wrap skirt with layers of lace, a draped skirt with a petal back and a regular back, 
and three kinds of fishtail skirts. I'm also going to teach you the easiest way I found to create pleats, knife pleats, rolled organ pleats, box pleats, a box pleated skirt with a yoke, stitched top box pleats, and how to quickly create an accordion pleated skirt and a sunburst pleated skirt. In the dresses workshop, I'll teach you how to create a gathered dress with a sheared waistband, a polka dress with a big ribbon in the back, a spring dress with a ribbon on the waistband, a maxi dress, a jolly chick style dress, an elegant gourd dress, a club dress with a gathered skirt and gathered neck straps, a bad girl dress made of many pieces, a tigeress dress with crossing neck straps, how to turn a basic skin tight dress into a sexy seductress dress, how to make an executive dress, a dress with an unironed box pleated skirt, an elegant long velvet dress, a red riding hood costume with a corset, corset strings, gathered skirt, off the shoulder puffed sleeves and a big ribbon, as well as a lady in waiting costume. I've also included a bonus walkthrough how I created this Juliet dress costume. In the pants workshop, you'll learn the basics of how to make pants that fit, how to make several kinds of loose, soft hanging yoga pants, how to change the physical properties to change the way the pants hang, how to make puffed royal pants, two kinds of Ottoman pants, skin tight leggings with holes, how to make a pair of exercise pants with a sheared waistband, how to make a harem skirt pants, How to make gorge dance pants. How to make fancy flared bottom pants and a pair of sport pants with side pockets. As for men's pants, I'll teach you how to make men's swim shorts, men's board shorts with a ribbon, men's jeans and how to make a belt including a placeholder buckle in MD. Thread the belt and attach it well to the pants. In the capes and cloaks workshop, I'll teach you how to make a hooded cape with a ribbon, Two ways to make a stiff rim to keep the hood's shape, how to make a cape of many pieces and the benefits of making it this way, how to make a pixie cape with a pointed hood, how to make a hero cape, how to make two kinds of torn capes, a spiky vampire cape, and a layered vampire cape with a special collar, a wizard cloak, and a jetty style cloak. And lastly, in the hoods and hats workshop, you'll learn the basics of how to make different shaped hoods, pointed hoods, standing up hoods, a robber's mask, a hoodlum hood, closed hoods, elastic hoods, a two-piece hood, and a three-piece hood, which is commonly used for jackets. In the hat section, I'll teach you how to make a cap hat, a beanie, a witch's hat, and a floppy sun hat. Last of all, I'll teach you how to create a Victoria's Secret bathrobe and how to tie the knot and keep it from opening up again. So basically that's it guys, and I hope you join me on the marvelous journey.